Hello guys, welcome back to a brand new video and welcome back to Championship Addiction. I hope you guys had a fantastic Christmas. Um, just before we get started, this video is sponsored by LOL T-Shirt Company. You might have heard of them before. Um, they sell my merch and link from my merch is down in the description below. So make sure you feel free to go check it out after watching this video. Um, you know, it's coming up towards the new year, so perhaps you want to get your kids some or whatever, you know, just go, feel free to go check it out, um, and tell me what you think of it as well, would you like to see some other ideas by me, and um, please feel free to put it all down in the comments below. Um, but anyway guys, you know what I do, so guys, you know what to do, subscribe for more, thanks for watching, and let's go. So the first game I'm going to talk about is Birmingham versus Leagues. Um, Leagues 1-1. At home to Preston, they went one nil down in that game as well. Um, you know, I'm very slightly disappointed by leagues. And um, well, I've seen what I would have done to the table if uh, Preston would have won that game. Um, Birmingham are, uh, you know, drew one one. Uh, so yeah, drew one one. Um, at, away to Blackburn. Disappointed day for Birmingham, but I don't think you should be downhearted if you are. About that result, as you know, because Black Men are doing ever so well this season. Um, this game's going to be a bit of an interesting one, I think, overall. Um, you know, you've got Leeds trying to push for a promotion, you've got Brentford, who only eight points behind them now. They've drew and they've lost their past couple of games as well, Leeds United. Um, but Birmingham are on the way up as well, slowly but surely. Um, but as far as this result goes, I'll go for a 2-1 Birmingham City win. My next one is Bristol City versus Luton Town. Um, Bristol City losing 3-2 away to Charlton Athletic. Um, very disappointed day by Bristol City. Luton drawing 3-3 three, three at home to Fulham. Great point for Luton Town um, over, you know, that game. It's got to be an interesting one, this one, because Bristol City have lost their past couple of games. Um, Bristol City were very much like on the edge of the playoffs and in the playoffs, but now Bristol City are sitting in 10th with 35 points. Um, Luton, you know, still in the relegation zone. Stoke have just came out of the relegation zone. Um, it's still tight down that bottom half of the table. Uh, but I've got to look on the more confident side of both teams, which I am. And I'm going to go for a 2-0 Luton Town win. My next one is Fulham versus Stoke. Um, just that you mentioned the Fulham result. Uh, 3-3 away to Luton. Um, Stoke beat Sheffield Wednesday 3-2 this previous uh, Boxing Day. Um, this game is going to be, I think, a bit of an interesting one because Stoke are going to want to try and start finding their feet. Um, Stoke, uh, Fulham, sorry, you know, I just literally stand in that player places by the skin of their teeth. Only two points in between Fulham, who are 39, and you've got Knox Forest and Swansea, both of 37 points. So this is going to be a very interesting weekend um, when all these games are done. Um, going forward and giving my predictions, I'll go for a 2-1 Fulham win. My next one is Huddersfield versus Blackburn Rovers. Um... Huddersfield losing 1 0 away to Middlesbrough. Blackburn 1 1 at home to Birmingham. Um, first real, well, I can't say disappointment for uh, Huddersfield because, you know, it is a bottom of the table clash. Um, it was, and, you know, it is. I think that, you know, every new manager gets that magical spark. Um, so, you know, fair play to uh, Middlesbrough. Um, going on the other side of Blackburn, 
I'm going to actually say this now because obviously the further we get into this, I think that Blackbird's going to reach the playoffs. Now you can all laugh at that, but I'm looking at the table in front of me and it's just three points between Preston, Fulham, Sheffield Wednesday and Blackburn. So only one game away. So I've, I'll put my money on that. If I'll put my money on Blackbird to reach the playoffs. Uh, but as far as the result goes, I'll go for a 3 nil Blackburn win. My next one is Millwall versus Brentford. Um, Millwall 1-1 one, one away to Cardiff. Brentford beat Swansea City 3-1 at home. <coughs> Sorry, I have got a bit of a cold. If I do cough, I do apologise. Um, Millwall... Oh, this, I think this game's going to be interesting. You've got Millwall in 12th. And you got Brentford up in third. <coughs> and looking to, to uh, get that relegation. Uh, not relegation, top of the table clash. Um, more than likely going to catch things of anyone. As far as this result goes, I'll go for a 2 1 Brentford win. My next one is Nottingham Forest versus Wigan Athletic. Um, Wigan Athletic 1-1 one, one at home to Derby. Great point for uh, Wigan. Nottingham Forest beating the whole city 2 0 away from home. Great three points for Nottingham Forest as well. Um, I can't doubt Wigan. I mean, they're bottom of the table, but they're just one point off safety at this present time. Um, I don't. I don't want to say it yet, but I think. The relegation is going to come down between four clubs over the next couple of weeks. Obviously, it goes on results. Um, going forward, how do I predict this one? I mean, Notts Forest lost their last two um, previous to this win. Um, Wigan, uh, it's going to be a bit of a hard one, I think. Um, but I'll go for a 2-1 Nottingham Forest win. My next one is Preston North End versus Reading. Um, Reading beat a QPR 1-0 at home. Preston North End 1-1 uh, away to Leagues. Preston went 1-0 up in that game as well. Um, but still a great point for Preston um, as I said it's so tight it's just three points between Blackburn and Sheffield Wednesday up in fourth um, this game's going to be in I mean we didn't have been playing too badly either um, ok they lost this previous weekend but they drew and they won two previous to that um, is this going to be a bit of a downhill for Reading I'll go no, and I'll go for a one all scoreline for that one. My next one is QPR versus Hull City. QPR losing 1-0 away to Reading. Um, Hull City losing 2-0 at home to Nottingham Forest. Both teams got really disappointed. Both teams are, yeah, close one point between... Uh, yeah, one point between the two clubs and one place between the two clubs. Which I'll go, I'll go for a 0-0 scoreline for that one. My next one is Sheffield Wednesday versus Cardiff City. Cardiff 1-1 one, one at home to Millwall. Sheffield Wednesday losing away... You losing 3-2 away to Sheffield Wednesday at uh, Stoke City. They can't lose to themselves, obviously, do. Um, but this game, yeah, I think, there, I think there's a lot of interesting games going forward this weekend entirely. I mean, you've got Cardiff in 11th and you've got Sheffield Wednesday in, up in 4th. But it's just five points. Five points between them. Um, look at their form table. 
you know, Cardiff won their last game and then drew three. I really don't know how to call this one. Um, I'll go for a 1-0 Sheffield Wednesday win. My next one is Swansea City versus Barnsley. Don't know why I've done the accent again. I need to stop doing that. Um, Barnsley won one at home against West Brom. Great point for Barnsley there. Um, the Swans lost 3-1 away from home to um, Brentford. Both these teams, I mean, that's a great point for Barnsley. Let's not knock it. You know, uh, drawing against the top of the table. Um, Barnsley are now currently sitting in 23rd. Um, that, as I said, that's a great point for uh, Barnsley there. Um, on the other hand, Swans. How do I think the Swans are going to do this weekend? I'm going to say this is an upset. And I'm going to go for a 2 0 Barnsley win. My next one is West Bromwich Albion versus Biddlesworth. And um, West Brom 1 1 away to Barnsley. Uh, Middlesbrough beating uh, Huddersfield Town 1 0 at home. Now, this is another game where you're looking at both ends of the table Middlesbrough 19, West Brom top. Um. But do I think that's a big turning point for Middlesbrough over the past few weeks? I'm going to go yes. And I'm going to go for a 1-0 Middlesbrough win. My last one for this weekend is Derby versus Charlton. Derby 1-1 away to Wigan. Um... You know, this point day for Derby, Charlton Athletic beating Bristol City 3 to at home. Great three points for Charlton. Um, where are Charlton, and it, by the way? 17. So, nobody promoted, ain't doing too badly. Um, going forward, there's just one place between the two clubs. There's just one point between the two clubs. I'm going to stick up for Charlton to win this one. And I'm going to go for a 2 0 Charlton win. But anyway, guys, you know what to do. Give us a little big thumbs up if you enjoy it. Subscribe for more. Thanks for watching. Ciao for now.